um, building circuits lab. And then I'm going to make a copy of this so I'm not actually doing it in yours. We're going to use this delightful simulation that we've been using a bajillion times this quarter. Quarter's coming to a close. Kind of crazy. What do we have, like three weeks left, something like that? Dang. All right, we're getting there. Um, I don't know, sometimes I get the, um, what are you going to do, sitting on camera? Okay, so as this is, man, here we go. Okay, so we're going to build four different circuits. There are four different pages to this assignment. Build the circuit, screenshot it, put that bugger in there. Um, so build the circuit with one battery, multiple wires, uh, and two or three bulbs. We're adding additional identical bulbs and only bulbs, uh, bulbs and wires, makes every bulb less bright. Um, so, whoop, whoop, bloop, bloop, bloop. there's nobody, it's been an odd morning, I, sound effects feel necessary. Whoop, bloop, bloop. Um, okay, so if I uh, add one bulb, you so one bulb is this bright yeah now there are multiple ways to add additional bulbs to this circuit there are right i mean there are some that might feel initially obvious but now our goal for this one is so that i add another bulb and every bulb every bulb is less bright so um, I'll let you think about how you want to do that. So with just one bulb, so these are two separate circuits. This is not doing the assignment question just yet. So now these two bulbs, same brightness, right? If I look at the length of these light rays, uh, they're the same. So now if I make this one, I want to make a circuit so that if I add an extra bulb, every bulb is less bright than it was a moment ago. So if I put that there and I put this in between, these two bulbs are the same brightness, but they're both dimmer than what they would have been if it was just one bulb individually. So if I have all bulbs on the same path, then each bulb is dimmer. I hope that makes sense. And what we're saying now is that here with just one bulb, one battery, if this bulb, pardon me, if this battery provides nine volts, then this bulb uses nine volts. For this circuit, same battery, still nine volts. This bulb uh, has a resistance of 10 ohms. This bulb has a resistance of 10 ohms. This bulb has a resistance of 10 ohms. All bulbs are identical, all batteries are all identical, all wires are identical. This battery gives nine volts, this bulb uses nine volts. This battery gives nine volts, this bulb uses four and a half. This bulb uses four and a half back to zero, right? Plus nine, minus 4.5, minus 4.5, back to zero. Plus nine, minus nine, back to zero more energy used by this one bulb, this one bulb is brighter. So if I add them all on the same path, then they're all going to get dimmer. So uh, that's the sort of thing that we're talking about for that first one, uh, screenshot that bugger. Um, I don't think you guys can see the act of me taking a screenshot. Um, uh, come on, I'm trying to right now. It's, there we go. So screenshot, Lordy, copy, and then shoop, paste, 
and that's like what we can do. Um, then this one talks about adding bulbs where the brightness of the bulbs do not change. So we've only got one minute left, but I think we can get this part done in that minute and you can still be set up for some pretty good success. Um, here are that one. Uh, so let's see. Um, we might go like a couple of seconds past, but uh, try to set this stuff up. So if I go like, good Lord, this, this, so this is again, just one bulb. This one bulb has the same brightness as that. Now I wanna add a second bulb that has the same brightness as this bulb. Adding a bulb does not change the brightness. If I do that on its own path, not in series, but adding a bulb on its own path, we should see that this next bulb should have the same brightness. I'm sorry, I'm uh, going a little bit into it's 11.30 right now, um, but in a second we'll be done. So um, the assignment for today, part one and part two, we just did, see, adding this bulb on its own path, each of these bulbs are the same brightness. Um, and you notice this one lit up before this one was built. So the bulbs don't affect each other, the paths don't affect each other. Uh, if we say this battery gives nine volts, this bulb uses nine volts back to zero. If we take that outermost path, the battery provides nine volts of potential, this bulb uses nine volts of potential back to zero. So, and then I would screenshot this and throw that bugger in here. There we go, bada bing, bada boom. These next two are really just like putting switches in there so that uh, you can turn off all bulbs or just one bulb. Um, and I'll let you guys do that on your own. You can do it. Uh, I hope that makes sense. I'll uh, take this video and break it down into a chunk looking at the notes and into a chunk looking at this assignment. And there you go. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know. I'll uh, stop the video and I'll stay on the call for a second or two to see if you guys have any questions. Have a great day, folks.